Hello, Scott here with Synthesizers.com and today let's do some modular basics. So first things first, we're going to want to bring some MIDI into our system, in this case from a keyboard. Now my MIDI keyboard is connected to this MIDI interface. So the first thing we want to do is take the pitch out and plug it into the one volt per octave input on this oscillator. We'll select the waveform that we want. Mm, let's do pulse. Standard synth patch routing would want you to shove that into a filter, so we're going to do that. Then we'll take our filter out into our VCA, which of course will then go to our output. Now, this will respond to pitch. However, the note will sound constantly. So we need to control the amplifier, and we're going to do that with an envelope generator. So we come back to our MIDI interface, but this time we take the gate signal, and we're going to patch that into the input of our envelope generator. We'll then take the output, and we'll use that to control our VCA. Okay, now we're responding to pitch and we're responding to note on and off, we can start to shape our sound a little more, and we can do that with the filter. Just like our amplifier, we can control our filter with an envelope generator. In fact, let's control it with the same envelope generator. So here's the output from our envelope generator, but instead of it going straight into our amplifier, we're going to shove it into a multiples module. We can now take one of our multiples signals and use that to once again control the VCA, but now we can take another copy of that signal and use that to control our filter. So now, changing the shape of the envelope changes the shape of our sound, and we can go from short and plucky to longer and brassy, and anywhere in between. So we've got our basic synth patch all set up, so now it's time to talk about modulation. Now I think the most simple form of modulation I can show you is vibrato, and for that we're going to need an LFO. Now, in the Synthesizers.com system, all oscillators can be made into LFOs by switching the range to low. Let's select a frequency that's going to make a nice vibrato, and let's grab a good old-fashioned sine wave. So, we'll take the sine wave from our LFO, and we're going to put it into the linear frequency input on our audio oscillator. Dial it in a bit, and hey presto, vibrato! Now all vibrato is, is modulation of the pitch of your oscillator, but pitch is just one of many things that you can modulate on a modular system. Some notable others include the filter. The amplitude. And if you're using square waves like we are, PWM, or pulse width modulation. Mm. 